Hello everybody, this is Grim Skellington again. This is gonna be another Minecraft Let's Play Adrift. And I have a whole laundry list of user video viewer suggested things. Whatever you'd call those. But thank you guys for all that. Anyway, so the first thing on my list of things to do is I need to go below decks, and then it suggested I check the cannons. I don't know if there's actually anything in here other than arrows. He just said check them just in case. So, I'm checking. Uh, I think they are all supposed to have 10. That one had 3 because I fired a couple off in first episode, I believe. Yep, more arrows. That's a lot of arrows, so if I can get a bow, this could be really helpful with fighting things. Um, yep, okay, so, they're mostly just arrows. I might as well go ahead and destroy those. It makes me kind of sad. Those were the last bits of those awesome cannons. But... Some things just gotta go, you know. So, I'm gonna be destroying these, and then after that, my next thing on my laundry list of things to do is that I'm gonna add some doors to the side of this. Because if I'm gonna have a little reed island thing over there, I might as well put doors here. And then I don't have to go find, go climb up the annoying little ladder of dirt, stairs of dirt that I have going right now. So, once I get that done, it'll all be good. It'd be nice and convenient, and I'm all for convenience. Oh, you see, I hate, I always do that, where I always just anticipate where it's going to be, and then I ch change where my cursor is, and nope, it wasn't. And <laughs> you just lost it. And it makes me get really annoyed, and oh, what have I done? I made myself lose the game. What have I done? What, what happened to my axe? My pickaxe? Oh, uh, you know, I bet I chucked that. Well... Okay, well, I'm one dispenser short. I don't think I'm ever going to be using those anyways, so... I'm not too upset. I'll get over it. Okay, so, that is my dirt stairs right there. I'm not entirely sure how far that down that comes here. But, um, let's see here. If I make my door... I don't know how to do this if I'm going to keep the windows intact. Should I add them part of the windows? I mean, I could. It's kind of lopsided if I do it like that, though. Let me see... If I do it right here and then have a window off to the side, maybe, maybe, hmm, here, let me go back up and I'm going to make my doors first. <laughs> yeah, I'm getting a little ahead of myself. I don't even have the doors ready yet. So, to make the doors, I need to get six of these, two, three, I'm probably going to have two doors on each side, so four, that was five, silly me, that was five again. I'm really bad at this counting thing. Oh, yuck, and they don't even stack. I hate it when things don't stack. It becomes quite a nuisance. Alright, um, got those there. Is that five? That's, looks like it's five. I don't know if I actually made five, but I have five, so it's all good either way. So I'm going to head back down now. Is it? And it looks like it's about to become nighttime. So if I'm doing much around outside, I'll probably end up turning on the gamma light for you guys. I'm not sure if I'll end up needing it or not. I'm not sure how torchish it is. You know, I'm fully aware that torchish isn't a word. So, if I'm going to have them lopsided, it's at least going to be consistently lopsided. Oh, why did I do that? Two, there we go. Three, door. This is going to be pretty convenient, though. Awesome. And my reed, it's growing. You are not going in the water. Bad reeds. <laughs> I did not plant two here, so you could leave. Okay. Might as well go ahead and stay out here. I'm going to need to put some torches on the side here as well, though. Ah, oh, I keep falling in. Maybe I should expand this as well. There's so many things I need to do. Okay, I'm going to make it here and here. There we go. And there we go. All right. And now I have my doors. Uh, I should probably make some glass for that, but first thing, the glass is going to go to the house up there because that's part of an actual objective. So, that is going to be on my to-do list as soon as I get around to having the supplies. And I'm going to need to make sure to shut these doors because I don't want anything to come in here. And while theoretically nothing should be spawning in the water, I... I'm not the luckiest person in the world. I'd rather not to risk it. There we go. But that should prevent them from spawning on the... Der the land strip thing right there. That thing. Anyways. 
Uh, yep, that's empty now. I'm gonna go ahead and destroy this chest because it's just kind of out here in the middle of everything and taking up space. And then, my next thing on my laundry list of things to do is get the gold. All this gold. All these chests have a crap ton of gold. So I'm gonna grab a bunch of that. I'm gonna go make some armor and blocks and stuff. Because, hey, I might as well. That should be enough for now once I fill my inventory. I'm going to go ahead and make these into gold blocks. You can always reduce them back down into regular ingots afterwards anyways, so I don't need to worry about accidentally losing any gold with this. Uh, oh, yes, good, my bricks are done. This should finish me off as far as the amount of bricks that I need total. Now I can go back upstairs. No, I need to make a crafting botch. Botch. I need to make a crafting botch down here. A crafting bench down here. That way I don't have to keep going upstairs. I think that might end up becoming my base of operations in the end. So normally I'd end up splitting these up, but I have enough here right now that I can just kind of stack these all up. And just get 964. You know, that would have been a good way to get an ac uh, estimate of it. Is just get the total amount of stacks I have divided by 9. Wow, yeah, actually I think I could build a fair amount with this. I completely underestimated the amount that I had. It's rather staggering, really. Okay, um, let's see here. And then just kind of break these up. Distribute bits of it. Ah, whatever, that'll give me 32, and then I'll split whatever else needs splitting up after that. Just gonna go ahead and grab all of it. 32, yep. It's the right amount. Split, split. Hmm, no. Oh, you see, I'm right back in that same boat as I was last time. Oh well. Got that. And I'll just stack these back up. It's not worth distributing them again. This is 104 blocks of gold. Oh, of course, I could do the advanced mathematics required for this, but you know, last episode when I couldn't figure out what 12 divided by 3 was. <sighs> Sometimes I confuse and befuddle myself. Alright, so what should I do with this? I mean, I was thinking, hey guys, I got all these gold blocks. That's awesome, right? And then I was also kind of thinking, hey, gold blocks, I'll get inspiration, right? I'm not quite getting the inspiration I was thinking I was. Uh, most of this ends up looking natural, and gold blocks look pretty unnatural. Um, hmm, let me see. Maybe this would be cool. I don't know. I was thinking, perhaps, if I destroyed this thing, the thing that sticks out, made out of trunks here, and replaced it with gold, perhaps... I know some people were suggesting that I fill in the bottom of the boat with it, but I mean, this is gold. It's supposed to be shown off. And yeah, I know I'm going to have to jump into the sea afterwards to grab this. It's unfortunate necessity. There we go. And then I'm just going to do it reverse style now. Oh, this is going to be a nuisance. I don't know how I'm going to get down there. Well, it might not be an exact replica of the one that I'm destroying by the time I'm done. <laughs> there we go. And... I unfortunately don't have a lot of the sort of tricks of the trade that a lot of Minecrafters end up acquiring over their experience building, I guess. No! What have I done? I didn't mean to do that. Well, while I'm down here, I might as well get my wood. Get my wood on. You see... That came out so much worse than I ever thought it would. It's moments like this that make me wish that I had the ability to think before acting. Think before saying things. Ouch! Oh, and I lost some health there, too. If I had died, that would have been a lot of stuff to go back and get, and I probably would have died going back to get it again. Look at this! My reeds are finally being cooperative. There. Ha! Ah, and you're not going into the ocean. I'm just gonna... Pl my plan is just kind of plant these all along here. Plant them all along the other side. And after I have it all filled up there, I'm just going to grab them all as they pop up and turn them into bookshelves. That's my plan, at least. Okay, let's see here. Now, my plan had been to do this, and then I cut that, and I place that, and place it back up. And this is supposed to look right. I think it does. Yep, doesn't look like there's anything hiding over the hiding over on the other side there. Uh, let me get my axe. Wonderful. Bloop. Okay. 
And is that right? It looks right. Hope it's right. If it's not right, well, I made a fool of myself. But hey, nothing new there. Er. Oh, you see, the m that's the problem. Is that the mast ends up going down this way us this way as well. Now <laughs> hiding behind the planks I've just placed, of course. I had placed those there just so I could drop down for convenience. Now if I destroy this... Oh, wow, this is like the um, spinal cord of the ship. Now i got to remember that. That should be part of the title. Something about spinal cords and ships. Maybe I should replace the whole spinal cord with gold. I mean, of course it would be the most unseaworthy ship ever, but it would look really cool, I think. Uh, yeah, like like I said before, though, with this these sections right here, I'm going to add gomelet because I don't have any torches out right here. Speaking of which, I should probably do that at some point. Maybe that's where the, that spider came from a while back. That would make a lot of sense. Oh, hindsight. Okay, uh, do I have any other spare blocks? Uh, yes, I do. Normally, I would put dirt there. But unfortunately, in this challenge, the dirt's really valuable because it's so hard to get. So, uh, th uh yeah, I think I'm going to fast forward it here now that I can turn off the gamma light. It's because if I'm going to be replacing the spinal cord of the ship, at least down to the water line, well, with the slow progress that I'm making as far as inching my way down, it, it might be a while. So I'll, I'll see you guys in a little bit. Uh, that's all I plan to do. Now, at least. For now, at least. Alright, see you guys in a minute. Alright guys, and I'm back, and I've replaced the part of the spinal cord and the little pointy thing at the front with gold there. I think it looks pretty cool. It definitely looks a lot more valuable. Maybe I should replace the masts as well. You know, if I just replace all the parts that are supposed to be tree trunks that aren't part of an actual tree with gold? I don't know. Uh, if, you guys, if you guys think that would be a good idea, leave it in the comments. I'll kind of leave this up to you guys, probably. Um, yeah. Anyways, I'm going to finish, now I'm going to spend the last two, three minutes I have left on this video, I'm going to go up, and I'm going to try to finish the house up there. So, also, thank you guys, really, I, I really appreciate the comments, as you can see, I do take them seriously, I frequently will do what you guys request that I do, if I think it's a good idea, in which in this case, I thought it was a great idea, I liked all of them, and if I do that again, I'm probably going to die. Oh well. Okay, so, if I place this here... Here, 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 here. Hmm, this isn't going to give me quite as many bricks as I thought it would. I really hope this is enough. If it's not, I'm not going to be terribly happy. Uh, wait, oh no, of course. I was thinking that this was still gold blocks, which require significantly more. And, yeah, this will give me plenty here. I was worried that it w I was going to get, what was it, three, four bricks out of it? Which, I don't, I get nine. Yay. And if I get one more brick, I get, make, I get ten. But I think this is enough. If my calculations were originally correct and nothing has changed in the meantime and I remembered to grab them all, it should be correct. So, that is what I'm banking on. I am very sorry, Cactus Buddy, but I need to destroy your face for a second. And then take back the torches and all that. I am going to finish... I'm just going to add the um, brick along here. I think that's about as tall as I want it to be. My current plans are to have it there and then to take out this floor here because there's still the office down below that currently I can't access. Oh, yes, I can. Does that mean that there's two floors I can work with? Awesome. Great. Okay, if I destroy this here, do I drop down? How far do I drop? Yes! Cool. Okay, so I'm just going to hollow out these two spaces here, and then I'm going to use those just as a giant, kind of, almost of a tower inside of the ship. Those are my current plans, and so, yeah, let me place these real quick. I might have to destroy some of that. I don't know. Or I'll just make more clay. It's not like I have to have a strict amount, and that's no more. That's just at least. 